hey hi friends welcome back to the our channel in this project i will just demonstrate of this gps tracker device with fire alert i mean suppose if any fire alert will be generated in any house or anywhere then gps sending this proper gps location and fire alert message in your mobile phone okay let's go and start to make this project if you not subscribe my youtube channel please subscribe and press the bell icon to get notification first I will publish this more than 200 video in my YouTube channel and I will publish this article in our website www.justoelectronics.com Just do electronics All about electronics Now see this component which component I use in this project First I open this box Here I just designing this PCB in zero PCB I connect this two push button and in back side I soldering all these connections. Now I connect this Arduino Nano microcontroller board. Attach with female header. Now I connect up this new 6M GPS model. And then I connect up this SIM 800 l GSM model. This one is the lithium iron battery. This one is the rechargeable battery and is providing this 3.7 volt. The whole circuit work in this 3.7 volt. And here is this flame sensor is detecting this fire. Now I connect this flame sensor. Okay, let's see the circuit diagram. In this circuit diagram, I use this Arduino Nano microcontroller board. new 6m gps model they work in this uart is required only the tx rx vcc and ground pin the tx will be connected to this the vcc will be connected to this 5 volt and the ground will be connected to this ground and the rx pin will be connected to this pin number d8 and the tx will be connected to this pin number d9 here is the sim 800 l gsm model this one is the really small and compact size it is working on this uart is required only tx rx vcc and ground pin the VCC will be connected to this 3.7 volt and this TX will be connected to this pin number D3. So the TX will be connected to this pin number D2 and RX will be connected to this pin number D3. VCC and ground will be connected to this ground. In left side, when we connect to this one push button, one push, one push button terminal will be connected to this 5 volt and this connected to this one register and the register value is this 10K and the push button will be connected to this D5 pin number. Here is this flame sensor is detecting this fire and the flame sensor will be connected to pin number D11. The ground will be connected to this ground and this is will this one is the second push button and they will be connected to pin number D6. Okay, let's see this hardware. This one is the really compact size of this project and I providing all this connection like Arduino Nano. Now I providing this all this connection in this one zero PCB. Now I attach this SIM card. Here you use any SIM card. I mean this is not required this 3G or 2G SIM card. Is work on this 4G SIM card also. In India is Geo will be not supported. Now I attach this flame sensor. Then I connect to this 3.7 volt lithium iron battery. And here I just connect this new 6M big antenna because the small antenna is not work perfectly. Comment section so many students will be asking sir why my new 6M is not work because if you use this small antenna is not work perfectly. You use this bigger antenna then it's work. Now see JSM get the signal properly. GPS will be take this few minutes to get this signal. Now the hardware will be completed. Okay now see this code. First, we install this tiny GPS dot plus plus dot s library. The flame sensor connect to this pin number T11. The GSM will be connected to this pin number 2, 2 and 3. And the GPS will be connected to this pin number 8 and 9. This one is the void setup function. And this void loop function, when you clicking this push button, the alert, emergency alert message will be going to this particular mobile number. And when is the fire will be detected, then it's sending this fire detected message to this particular mobile number. Okay, now we'll go to this tool, select this proper board. Here I just use this Arduino Nano microcontroller board and hit this compiling button. See this code will be compiled properly. Now see this working of this project. GPS will be get the signal. And also GSM will be get the signal. Now we test this all project features one by one. First we clicking this push button. 
and when i release it after the few seconds the emergency alert message will be providing to this particular mobile number and you clicking this tab to load preview preview and then it's sending this proper emergency alert message when i clicking this tab to preview then it's automatically show this latitude longitude when you clicking this google map location the automatically open and it showed that this perfectly accurate gps coordinate okay now just taste this flame sensor i mean this fire detected when i put this fire to this near of this flame sensor then gsm sending this text message fire detected and is sending this proper gps location this one is really amazing and just click this tab to view this and it showed that this proper gps latitude longitude i hope you like this project and if you like this project please hit the like button share with all the friends if you new in my youtube channel please subscribe my youtube channel press the bell icon to get notification first thank you for watching have a nice day